Well, how is a computer like a grandparent? The first thing that goes on both is their memory. <laughs> <laughs> Dementia is a global issue. It's something that societies are facing. And if we don't have a way to stop the progression, that number will nearly triple by mid-century. To take care of all these people is going to bankrupt the healthcare system. They told me I only had 20% of what my memory should be. The pain of knowing you're losing your mind. I don't know how much time I have. <laughs> no cure. Nothing can be done not really acceptable to us. For the first time in two decades, the FDA has approved an Alzheimer's drug. Some neurologists are hailing the new drug, but many experts aren't. The FDA Advisory Committee voted against it. I don't think we've ever seen a failure in scientific research on this massive a scale. How many people here would like to avoid dementia? The idea was there's nothing you can do about it. Nothing could be further from the truth. We're targeting many factors that all contribute to this illness. These are things that you can fix. The research that he's doing now, it's not research. It's a, it's a, he sells it. The response has been to ignore it, to deny it. He writes a best-selling book. This is not how it's done. People are dying when they do not have to. People finally realized they could fight for their memories. I mean, what's the harm? All these things that these people are doing, I can do that. When you have nothing, you have to start somewhere. I just started recognizing people. I could remember phone numbers again. It's pretty crazy how much she's improved. You don't want to do it for yourself, do it for your loved ones. I need you to know that dementia is not a death sentence. There's so many things that we can do to stop it. It really does work. Our generation will be the last generation to fear Alzheimer's disease. Memories for life. Reversing Alzheimer's.